I've been a teacher for the previous two years back in LA and I knew that I somehow still wanted to affect families and still work with families, but I wanted to do it from a different aspect, which is why I thought law school would be the next step. So I came here, I had uh, been accepted already, but, you know, I kind of fell in love with the school on my tour. That, that right there pretty much solidified it. My favorite thing here at Loyola that I've done was uh, being on the executive board of the Black Law Student Association. We uh, wrote the application that won our school, the Midwest Black Law Student Association Diversity and Inclusion Law School of the Year, which Loyola Chicago won last year. I ultimately hope that my work goes into community development. So I'm very passionate about bringing economic opportunities into underserved communities. I'm very passionate about home ownership. I'm very passionate about business entrepreneurship. So I hope to work with different communities in Chicago and even back in my hometown of Los Angeles to bring economic and employment opportunities to these areas. It's a big deal for my family, the first to kind of go and to get this level of education. It also encourages me, you know, when I get tired, I think about my family and how much they sacrifice. Me and my wife, we've been together since 2007. She's someone who's really encouraged me throughout law school. It really has meant a lot to have her throughout this whole process. There's no way I would have been able to be here earning a JD had other people not been very generous with their funds and, and helped out. It's a, it's a huge help. And I'm putting myself through law school like many other students here are. Because those scholarships came in, I was able to take an externship and not have to worry about you know, taking out more loans to pay for my tuition. It opens up doors for a lot of other people to get this type of education. Professor Amaker and Dean Appel, you realize the legacy that they left and the legacy that they're making right now. So to somehow have my name connected to both of those people is humbling. If we talk about diversifying the industry, people have to have an economic means of getting there. And that's what these scholarships help to do.